Silence can speak louder sometimes. And for the former Seahawks running back, it has been a powerful tool of protest. I wanted the film, you know, in the wake of Black Lives Matter, to make a film that, that contributes to the conversation, that shows how there are many ways of resisting the dominant culture. David Shields is the director of the film, which is an artistic collage of video clips that explores Marshawn Lynch's history as a football player from his hometown of Oakland to the NFL and the ways in which he pushes back against news media and football organizations. I think it was important for him to resist the sort of feel-good, upbeat tonality of Pete Carroll, of the 12th man, of Seattle cheerfulness. There's something deep in Marshawn that wanted to resist that Seattle, that we're all for one and one for all. It's all one big happy team. And I think his sense is, no, we're not. While Shields did not interview Marshawn for the documentary, he says his camp is aware of the film and Marshawn decided not to participate. I've always admired athletes who are larger than what we expected. The film has gotten support from some big names, including actor Danny Glover, who was an executive producer on the film and came out for the world premiere at the Seattle International Film Festival on Monday. They, they have a one stage in which they star on and, and are profound on in terms of their actions and the way they play and everything else. But then they take on another stage like Marcin Lynch. For fans, it's a chance to learn more about an icon. He's a cornerstone of the Seahawks. I mean, he's part of the uh, Legion of Boom. So I want to know what they're going to say about it. For Shields, he says the film in its final cut has made its way to Marshawn's camp, but he's still holding out hope that he might break his silence. For right now, he's being very Lynchian. He's being eloquent by being silent. The very fact that he's saying nothing, I'm taking as a, a quiet positive. And I have to brag that, that Marshawn Lynch's mom follows us on Twitter now. So <laughs> that, we're taking that as encouraging. Jenna Hanchard, King 5 News.